Hello everyone, Ian here at NAB 2019. I've come over to Sound Devices. I absolutely love these guys and their products. They have always brought innovative products and beautiful sounding products to the industry. And we are speaking with John today because they have released Scorpio. And Scorpio is just, well, it's, you know, the sum of what you've worked on for years now. And it, it's sort of a, the next big step on your product line. Indeed. I mean, really what Scorpio represents is, it's kind of, a, like you said, it's it's kind of the superset of everything we have. So kind of the, taking the best of what we've implemented in the 788, along with this, the interface and the kind of that user-friendly aspect of the 6 Series, and brought it into a product that is about the size of our 688, but with a tremendous amount of I.O. capability. You want to just touch on how many inputs we have, monitoring capabilities, output capabilities, and we have to, of course, talk about the visuals. You know, so what we've got in this little chassis here are, first of all, 16 microphone preamplifiers. So they're full featured preamps with phantom power and high pass filters and analog limiters and all those things you would expect from a Sound Devices product. But we also have the ability to have another 16 inputs and we can bring those in out over Dante. We can come in AES 42 with digital microphones. So we've got lots of different ways to get into the box. Uh, Dante opens up that audio over Ethernet, so that single cable connection where I can very simply take many channels of audio and interconnect in, among multiple environments. The, uh, the Scorpio has all these 16 mic preamplifiers, the 32 channels of Dante, and there are 32 channels in the mixer. And those channels, again, can be sourced from all those different types. And those 32 channels can be recorded to their individual track, plus the ability to record a left-right track and a couple of extra buses. So there's 36 tracks of recording. So there's, you know, again, we're talking about a superset here. These are for complex applications where you might be in a competition reality or uh, you know, ensemble cast, drama productions, those are the first customers that are excited about this. The, uh, in, in addition to that, from a, an audio routing capability, there are 10 buses. The first two buses are able to be recorded, so those are your spare buses, and then the other buses can be used for, you know, compl complex uh, comm routing, IFB, private lines, and things like that. So there's a lot of capability again, for more of those more complicated productions. The uh, recording capability is, uh, there's an internal solid state drive. There's also two SD card slots, and you can record to all three of those media simultaneously. The unit's powered off of external DC, and there's two external DC ports, and those are redundant and isolated. There's also Sony L-type camcorder batteries on the back side that can be powered and charge, so the external DC can charge that power. The, the Scorpio has the uh, ability to be controlled from an external device over USB MIDI protocol. And what we've got here is, this is an Android app, so I'm hardlined here, and so I see full metering of all my channels, I can arm, I can re remote record, I can do scene and take notes and all of the metadata that you're used to on a, our Wingland app. And then in addition to that, third-party controllers, like this, uh, this Icon product here, is able to control the product. So now you can have an external control surface over USB MIDI implementation. So that's, a, that's an open protocol, that's the MCU protocol. So just, you know, like you said, it's a big cast, yeah. it's a big production, lots of inputs lots of flexibility, and of course, having the capability to have internal and removable media. Uh, you're charging, you know, the ability to unplug and go, if need be. Uh, all that flexibility with the interface is fantastic. So, uh, price and availability. Price is uh, $89.95 uh, US dollars, and uh, availability is second quarter of this year. Okay, well we really look forward to uh, seeing more of it. Thanks so much, thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.